mate. Let me tell you about the Ozpic. Fantastic little completely portable combustion heater and cooker from Australia. Now, when you buy your Ozpig, your standard Ozpig comes with two hot plates. Because what you're buying is basically a pot belly stove, we put one of those hot plates on the side that acts as a warming plate. In other words, you can cook steaks, chops, etc. on this first one. See the way it rolls around directly over the fire? I can cook my sausages, then as they're cooked, I can take them off and keep them warm on this hot plate here. Now, if I swing that around, I can keep a pot sitting on there on the simmer with a good fire. I can keep a pot sitting on that warming plate with a good fire on the simmer, and I can cook a third pot. So if you're doing meat and three veg, say a stew, etc., you can then have three pots on the go at once. Now, another trick with the Ozpig is this. You get this funny shaped poker, so even when the fire's going, you can handle these hot plates. I pick that off, and I put that on the side. There's another slot there. Now I have twice the warming area. If you've got a big team at home and you want to do a proper barbecue, there's plenty of these around, folks. This is a cast iron hot plate off a gas-fired barbecue. Now look what I've got here. I've now got a full-size barbecue. I can cook steaks for 12 people, and I've still got all that warming space. Now, that's great as a cooker. What about as a heater? Now, when you finish cooking on your Ozpig, you can take your hot plates off, OK? We'll put this one back on the top. Take this one off completely. We don't need that now. Now it's my heater. Now, on a cold night with a good fire, I'm not joking, you'll get 25 people around one of these. You'll, everybody will be standing back at least six feet. With a good fire, they pump out and generate a lot of heat. The legs, because they're hollow, even though this fire here has been going since 8 o'clock this morning, are cool. These are perfectly safe on a wooden deck. They're a fantastic brazier on a wooden deck. The only thing I recommend is a small tray here to catch any ash which might fall out of the front. But they're perfectly safe as a brazier on a wooden deck. Now, the best thing about the Ozpig, I'll show them this one over here because it's a bit cooler, is this. When you buy your Ozpig, the flue is in three sections. All of those sections fit inside the body of the fire. Even the poker fits inside the body of the fire. The legs unscrew, they fit inside. We put these hot plates together on top, like this, and then you put it in your Ozpig carry bag. Now, if you look in here, you'll see that in there, there are the three flue sections, the four legs, which are seam welded steam pipe, by the way, folks. It's probably over-engineered, really. It's the strongest 20 millimeter galvanized pipe money can buy. So now your Ozpig is fully transportable. You can take your Ozpig to the beach. You can put it in your four-wheel drive, your jet boat, you can put it in your helicopter. Where have these been used? Well, I've... Huh. People put them in, in their Mai Mai's when they're duck shooting. Not only do they put them in their Mai Mai's, they put them in their white bait huts. Men put them in their man cave. They're a completely transportable combustion heater and cooker. Well, thanks for your time, folks. This is the Ozpig.